guys, it's Watch and we give it or watch you here, but it doesn't matter which one you call me. Anyway, I'm welcoming you back to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy. Not many letters today, but I won't give up. I didn't mean to talk to you, so yeah. Uh Yeah, anyway, in the last episode we went and did the gateway, which is up there somewhere, and we got ourselves a really cool power here that we can use only in the observatory and that one mission there that we did. And we also got a red star, the only red star in the game. Plus we went to the Hungry Luma that's by the garden. Or the, not the garden, the gate. And we got ourselves this thing and we can fly with it. And we shake, we can fly, hold A to steer around and we can fly around. We can only use it here in the one mission with the red star. But we got this power up and also got another star added onto our account, so... That was, that's really cool, and now we're actually going to fly up to the garden here, which is the first time. This is the garden, it's a secret room. Oh, so you're keeping secrets from us now. Anyway, just real quick, I'm going to show if you go over here, you can make yourself a shortcut to the garage, so you don't have to go up, so that you don't have to go up there and uh, do stuff anymore. But I honestly, now that I have the power up, I'll probably be flying almost everywhere, because... Flying is just really fun, and I like doing it, and that's pretty much probably what I'll be doing from now on, instead of using any warps or anything like that. I'll probably just be flying, because to be honest, flying is, like, really cool, and you can only do it here, so we might as well make use of it. Use of it. So let's go ahead and go into here and start up the garden. Alright. So, this guy just shows the maps, like every other guy inside of here, and... Even though it looks like you can walk off here, you can't. It's just background. But, who knows. Maybe it's a hologram or something. I have no idea. So, maybe we should go to the one... Alright, we're gonna go to this one. We'll go to that one after this one. <sighs> oh, I remember this one. I remember this one. For some reason, these boos look they look like they do in Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon to me. It just reminded me of that from this little thing like like that, and it just kind of looks like something that'd be in Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon and the boos. I don't know. Which I do have that game actually. I just uh, I didn't have it before, but I got it because it. I got it. I had some, you know, stuff. With, you know, because you know, I got it like around Easter because you know there's Easter money and that stuff. You know. Alright, but anyway, let's go into this jar! Deep Dark Galaxy, the underground ghost ship, and I almost forgot to say that! Hooray! Alright, now I think this is really kind of funny here, what these toads say. They're all here on this little beach thing, which the outside of here isn't really creepy at all. Which, it really isn't creepy on the inside, but it's a little bit more creepy than the outside. You can just get this one up right there by doing that. Now, if you talk to these toads right here, we're currently on vacate. Or we're currently on vacate. Or I mean, galactic survey duty. Please be patient with us. Bullcrap! You're on vacation. Stupid toad. Oh, look at this guy. Cannon, get all you can in the cannon. That was a really bad voice there, and this guy's still sleeping. Snore. <laughs> Snore. The way I said that, I don't know. Now, there's actually a thing over here. I don't know how many people know about it, but you're supposed to fire over here, alright? Well, there's a thing over here that we can get, which I'll come back up and I'll do that in actually a later mission. But for right now, we're actually just gonna get this little thing so we can get the star. Alright, so we got a Rainbow Mario star, and you need to come up here and get the Fire Flower to light those torches we saw in the opening cutscene, but if you kill these guys, you can get a lot of star bits. So you want to try and kill them all, plus they won't get in your way, which is really nice, and you don't want them to get in your way, because that would just really it'd stall you for time, and you really need to use all the time you can get to get the Fire Flower and just get down there right away. So just try and kill all the guys, and I think I actually got them, so that's actually pretty cool. Oh, one of them I missed, but we can just kill it the old-fashioned way. Alright, so now we got the Fire Flower, we're gonna rush over to the to the little Sling Star here and get on down there. And it, for some reason, lands you on a tree, but who cares. Now, it would've really sucked if I jumped back into the cannon there, but we're gonna, just gonna go ahead and uh, light these torches and move out of the way, you stupid crab. 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 
Now, while we have some left, we might as well kill the crab right there. Because I usually, if I have a little bit left, I'll try and kill as many crabs as I can, but... I only got to kill at one, but, well, whatever. So, we have a Magikoop over here that's just standing waiting for us. And we'll all kill it because it's stupid. Alright, so basically what you want to do here is just pretty much... Well, let's go talk to this toad over here and see what he has to say. Because we got the Bi Bo Giddy Toad in here, and no... It's not. It just looks like the one that's in Bowser's Inside Story, but that's not even possible because Bowser's Inside Story was made after this. The team is surveying an underground lake. Yeah, more like swimming in it. Alright, well, whatever. And we have bloopers here. I don't know if we've seen bloopers before, to be honest, but... Or, we have. I mean, not in this game, though. I don't know if we have. But you just basically want to go down here, and if you couldn't tell, go where the giant arrow is, because... I don't know. We probably should go where the giant arrow is now. What the heck? It is a toad. There are toads down here, so let's... Ow! Stupid blooper. Talk to the... There's a tunnel right here! Oh, yeah, you told me that. I already knew that. Well, still, I still think you're swimming in here, and you're just giving me a bunch of bullcrap. Alright, you just want to hit this lever here. Come on, hit the lever, please. I'm about to die. Please hit the lever, Mario! 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 You're gonna die! Oh, no. Alright, if I can run through here very quickly... There's a bubble over there! Bubble, bubble, bubble! Bubble, bubble, air bubble! Oh, we just barely got that. That was luck. Now, this, these things will blow up if you touch them, so you don't want to do that, but if you fire starbits at them, they'll also blow up, so... I guess you can do that if you want. Now, I need to be kind of careful, because I, I almost died there. Now, these things also... They hurt, they hurt you too, but there's no real way to, like, I don't think you can kill, uh, you can spin into them, I'm pretty sure, but I don't really want to test it out exactly, because I only have one piece of life left, or Mario does, so I don't have to worry about anything, it's Mario's life, right? Right? Nah, I'm joking. But yeah, so I don't really want to risk anything, because, yeah, that would just be bad, but let's just get up there, Mario, and let's go get a coin. Alright, so here we are. The ship we saw in the opening cutscene. Wait, no, I I, I'm, I think I can say it a different way. The ship we saw in the opening cutscene. The ships will set sail in the morning. No, I'm not doing it right. <clears throat> the ships will set sail in the morning. Uh, hey guys, we're back. I just ran out of room on the disc. Yeah, but I'm back. Excuse me while I cut away for a second. Okay, I'm, I gotta admit, I'm kind of glad that happened, because that was kind of funny. I'm just like, okay, guys, I'm back, and my disc just ran out. I just had to go change it. Phone rings. Excuse me while I cut away for a second. This <laughs> is like, pfft. even though I didn't exactly say it like that, that's how it kind of seemed like to me. Alright, so there's a light stream up, right up here if you want that. That's always nice. And we got Starbit stuff, which I don't know, it's not really that helpful to go over and get, but you can. And if you really want to... Got stuck in the sand, yeah, if you fall from too far, ground pound or anything, Mario will get stuck in the sand. If, if, I guess if you wanted to, you could kill the booze in the light, which I did by, with the one by, not even on purpose, but whatever. Get these things, they'll give you coins, but I don't even need them anymore, because I just got the light and I just... But also, one more thing I just want to show down here real quick. Over here, there's actually a thing, so coming down here, you can find that. Give yourself a lot of starbits. Sweet. Alright, we got over 100 starbits in this level, and I haven't even really died, actually, so... So yeah, all this isn't from building up just from dying, this is actually doing well, and I'm getting lost down here, I need to get out. Please. Okay, there we go. We finally made it out. No, don't go back down there. Dang it. Alright, now let's just actually do something right here. Camera. No. Alright, we're just gonna get out of this waters with this stuff. And just get up here like we're supposed to go. Ow. It's not nice. Come on, please. Alright. Yeah, you guys remember this this one? Camilla. 
yeah, that's her name. I don't know if I've mentioned it before, but she is back. Now, this one actually going to be a little bit difficult. A lot more than before. We're having a lot of bosses come back that we've fought before lately. So, basically, yeah, she'll start off like she did before down here. Take three hits down here, all right? So, just go ahead and do the same thing. Fire shells at her to hurt her. Wait for the fire shell spin to get the shells. Basically, the same thing. But there's a new thing there's in this. She'll actually do something else here that we'll get into when that comes, which... Which I'll show you what that is. Alright, now she actually goes up here. Alright, now that's the one hard thing about this. They have that little magic Koopas following you around. And there's actually a mission you can do on this, which is a one life challenge run. The Daredevil comment for it. Alright. Yeah, and that's the thing that makes it so hard, because you have to come up here and do that repeatedly over and over again. With all this fire running around, those little Koopas can fire too, which is what really makes it difficult. Especially if you, you can kill these Koopas down here, but... Alright, we'll just get that coin real quick. Come on, please. Alright. Die! No, I just fired that in the complete opposite direction. That was terrible aim. But taking them out really does help. I would recommend to do that probably sooner than I did. I kind of just waited a little bit, like I was just trying to do it with them still there. But it's not really, in the end, it just saves you time, kind of, because you're sitting there getting fire on. Now, if you could do it successfully without getting hurt, then it could have saved you time. But if you just... Oh, yeah, and it spawns new ones every time it gets hit, so that's another thing about it. And little ones, I'm just going to take them out. They don't give you coins anymore after they respawn, though, so that's another thing that is not very good. But, alright, just spawn, spawn, spawn. There we go. And she's done. Alright, now we destroy her magical staff that giving, it is giving her her power, so no more power for you, Camilla. Let's get the star. And let me see what the next mission is here. I think I'm just going to keep going for one more mission, hopefully. Oh, thank goodness. For a second there, I thought the Wii was going to say that no, can't read disk message. Oh, that's good. Alright. One more star, I think. I think the next one's not too long. Alright, come on, save, 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 save. Alright, there we go. Alright, now let's just go ahead and... Purple Comet in Orbit. No. We are not doing that yet. So we're just gonna go to this one that actually isn't that hard and won't take that long to do, so... Yeah, that will just end, we'll end the video off with this one. This will be the last star we'll do in this video, and then we'll end it off after that. Matter Splatter Galaxy, watch your step. This is actually not that bad a one. It's actually pretty cool. Now, what's really... It just puts you right over here. And all you gotta do is just make your way over here. Now, they do start to go away until the next drop comes back. But they're basically like raindrops just bouncing around. Just destroy that guy! Woo! make it there all right yeah it's not too bad it's actually not that hard all you just gotta just keep making your way this way long jumping can help just be careful that you don't time it wrong so that stuff doesn't come in time you just want to go as soon as that's done making those drops right there so that way you can get up there in time and yeah basically that's oh, I really had to save too much about that yeah, 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 yeah. and I survive which is cool Man, you guys are going- Stop going too far this way, man. Dang. I actually died in this mission. Oh. Oh, well. It'll be alright. Alright, we'll just wait for the droplets of the rain stuff. Alright. What? Alright, no. What am I doing? It's actually not fail this time. I think you can get something nice up there. If I Dang. 
Alright, go back, please. Thank you. I actually want to see what's up there now, because now I'm curious. And really? Oh, I made it up there. Sweet. There's probably something nice up here. Yeah, a pipe. Look at that. What did this just do? Did this just make me skip stuff? No, it didn't. It was like a little shortcut, I think. You can either go the other way, and I think it takes you around the, uh, another thing. I don't think I skipped anything. Or did I? Alright, guys, now, if you go the other way, not up that way, if you come over this way, I'm gonna show you what you get for coming over here. Which was nothing. The game was trolling me. Okay, guys, we're back. Now, I actually tried going the other way, and I was being stupid and forgot that this was the right way to go. The other way is just a troll way that actually isn't right. So, you actually need to come back over this way, which is okay. So, we're back over here then now. Alright, now this next part right here... This next part right here really, really can be tricky if you're not good with the spring mushroom. Just get that right there, and then it's you're just going to have to start going up this way. Now, you only have some chances to get up here. There are some blocks that you can't go through. You can only go through these ones, so you need to make sure you do it right. So right there, if you're still down there, you need to get up through that block. No other one. So we'll just climb the steps backwards. We're like a... We're... We're in like the opposite of a slinky going up backwards. I wouldn't really say the opposite. Now, you can actually... Th that thing over there... Or never mind. Yeah, that's gonna be that one up right there. Yeah, that's gonna be inside a cage. You're not a cage. I don't know why I thought that. Oh, really tricky to get this, but I did it anyway because I just felt like it. You need to make your way through this one and get up there, and there you go. All right, now we just gotta keep waiting for things to rise for us to see where to go and. We can get them and get us lots of starbits while we wait. Really, very, very nice. It's always wonderful to get them. And let's get up onto these platform. Alright, just keep rising up. We're almost there. And this one can be a little bit tricky. There's a little thing there. No! That was close. I actually forgot about the other things being over there. But anyway, all that stuff down there, you actually can't go on. They just pointlessly put it in there because there's no way to get down there unless you like hack the game. They just put it there for decoration, I guess. And did I just see something up here? What the heck? There is another one up up there. Isn't that cool? And I don't think... How in the world would you... Without a spring mushroom. You don't get a spring mushroom here, what the heck? You'd have to triple jump off this stuff. Oh, that's actually kind of tricky. And not really is worth it. Now this thing's just gonna start moving you... Face palm. Don't. Alright, well, whatever, we're just, alright, anyway, this thing right here, you basically need to choose the right path, that path over there is the wrong path, just want to keep going, now, actually, that, this path, actually, you could have jumped from over there, too, but, yeah, some things are wrong, I mean, not that they're wrong, you can pretty much survive from any one, but, you want to choose the one that will get you in the easiest spot, you just want to try and get lucky, or wait, like, you could jump there, just because, but, yeah, that's basically what you do, and then this ending thing is right over- Oh, there. Stupid magic book. Alright, let's just keep on moving. Now, you're gonna guess- Follow the stuff, that's one way you can tell where stuff is going to appear. By where the stuff is. So, I probably shouldn't have collected some of those starboard things like I was doing now, and whoa. No! Well, that was really actually kind of close. 
All right. So we survived our way out of this one. Now the one actually I want to take is I believe this one. I was right. And let's get our star. There we go. That's this galaxy in a nutshell. Actually, I don't know where that came from or why it's nutshell. I don't know if you think about it. Like we're so used to saying it, like that, you know, it doesn't seem like it's a thing that would be weird, but. You know, nutshell, like, really, where would that come from? Like, it's really weird that this, that, but, you know, whatever. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode, so, thank you guys for watching this episode of Super Mario Galaxy. In the next episode, we're gonna go... Well, let's see the map real quick. Alright, yeah, we're gonna go back to Deep Dark Galaxy, and do do the next star there so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys then bye